The floating rig is 180 kilometers offshore from Mossel Bay and uses 70,000 liters of petrol a day. The drilling, which started this past weekend, has so far reached 100 meters below the seabed, but it's hoped a depth of 3,500 meters will be reached. Mineral Resources Minister Nwako Ramaklodi flew in for a quick tour. We are hoping to strike gas or oil down there in South Africa. If we do succeed, that is said to be a game changer for the economy of the country and maybe uh, the subcontinent. The drilling is going ahead despite concerns over legislation which will give the state a 20% free carry in new projects and the option to acquire the rest at an agreed price. Well, the bill is uh, with the presidency. They are looking at it, checking for legalities. And uh, if it masters the constitutional uh, test, it, it will be signed. The drilling doesn't come without risks. It costs a million dollars a day to drill, and only one in seven wells is successful. But it seems this hasn't dampened the spirit of multinational firms who are lining up for a chance to explore for offshore oil and gas in South African waters. Sandy McCowan, Eric Rodet, Ocean Rig. You deserve to know more. ENCA.com.